Okay, uh, about to sous vide, or actually get four fillets ready for the sous vide. I'm actually only cooking one tonight, but I'm going to seal them all four tonight. I'm going to season them and seal them tonight and, uh, and cook them as needed. The only reason I'm showing this is, is this device right here, which is the uh, vacuum sealer. And I have tried the submerge the bag, and it works fantastic. It works great, and there's really nothing wrong with it. Other than I ran across this at a good deal, so I bought it. it the thing that I immediately noticed using a vacuum sealer is it really removes all the air. And it really pulls a good vacuum, obviously, and seals it down good. The, the biggest thing I noticed about the main thing that it matters is it gets all the air out. So, that being said, the steaks will sink better. They don't try and float. No water, no air ends up in a corner of a bag or any of that. It, they're, they're sealed, they're vacuumed, there's no air, they sink. You don't even have to weight them down. You literally drop them in the water. So that's the only reason I'm going over this. I think it's, uh, you know, it's a, they're about 150 bucks, you know, retail. And then you gotta buy bags. So they're not the cheapest thing in the world. And there's really nothing wrong with the Ziploc bag submerged in water. I'm, I'm, not, a, I'm, not, I'm not trashing that idea. It's just, it, if you got one of these, try it. I think you'll you'll be impressed with how much better it works. And and plus you can, you know, seal them, season them, seal them, put them in the refrigerator, and cook them as needed. But mainly because they sink and stay on the bottom. But that's all.